Hey guys, welcome to another SAS Lenny Page Teardown. Today we have Figma, which is a really good page, and I'll show you exactly why. So essentially what Figma does is like a design tool uh, that you use, uh, you know, for the design projects, uh, kind of like Sketch or Adobe XD and all these things. Um, the, like the main promise that they have, and this is like their main USB, is that it was designed for collaboration, where everything is in the cloud, everything is meant to be used with a team, and all these different things, right? So that's the forefront of every single thing that they do messaging wise, at least in the latest version. And that's why it's so good, right? Because they don't say, um, they don't have to explain uh, what the design tool does because the design tools are getting more and more similar and you know designers can quickly adapt. So what they're showing here instead, let me just refresh the page because I think it froze for whatever reason is just show that nothing's great is built alone is designed together all these different things and i think it's spot on usually i don't like things that that like change the text because it's really distracting and usually this uh, headline would be pr pretty vague but it tells them right away that this is a design tool built for collaboration right Which, that's what it's saying especially with the bare, bare awareness that they have they can totally pull this off it's it's really on point right so the the other thing that they do about this is they show you the usb right away and this is the best part either uh, in all stages of the design and development process, they show you how Figma can help throughout the entire way. So it can help you brainstorm the ideas, right? So they can quickly see that they can brainstorm the ideas and collaborate throughout the entire way. They can design the whole thing, right? So it changes to the design from the first wireframes to actually making it seem like a proper design like iterating and creating prototypes. They're actually showing everything, every single step of the, the design process, they're showing it right away. Um, and then or even like testing it and getting buy-in and getting feedback from customers, it, that's where collaboration comes in with these videos that they're showing on the side is like really spot on. Um, and then even with when it comes to building design systems and g sending this to developers uh, and having like guidelines and everything that the developer can come in and build, right? So from the, th this is, they show everything in order from the first ideas that they're gonna get about the product to the finished result or like a development uh, iteration or like implementing a new feature or whatever, or implementing a new design. Like from every single step, they show it in order how a Figma is gonna affect every single step of the way and make it way better. Right, so this is exactly what you want want to do with your tool. Kind of show how uh, typically people uh, like go through their uh, their process. Maybe it might be a tool for hiring, a tool for outreach, a tool for analytics, whatever it might be. You show them how it would affect every area of the pro uh, process, and then they'll see, whoa, this is a game changer, right? Uh, the only things that I would improve is uh, just show them that what is the community about. So basically what the community is about is sharing all these different resources um, and sharing all these different plugins that they can get because plugins are huge for Figma as well and designers love them. So I'll just make that a little bit more obvious that they can get uh, lots of plugins to speed things up. Um, and kind of give them a, a full list. And also that all these thousands and thousands of resources for things that they don't have to build and therefore um, speeds up the process or that they don't have to buy because some of these templates are free where you can pay for most of these things elsewhere, right? Uh, so that was really about it. I really like that they added here a, a call to action start with Google right away. Um, and this is perfect. Even the pricing is good because you can uh, people know it's for free. It's super clear the difference between free and play and paid. Uh, it's spot on. I have really not much to say about this page. So hopefully you enjoy this page. Let me know what you think about this page in the comments below. would love to hear it and kind of brainstorm a few ideas there. If you're interested in seeing how I can help you improve your conversions, go, just go to Cortez.design slash apply and book a free introduction call. All this is like a free 15 minute call to figure out if I can help you or not, or if the timing might be right. Uh, and then we'll check it from there. We'll book a strategy call to figure out what are the three or four things that we can tweak. And then I can give you an idea of how I work with clients and all this stuff, right? So to start off with, let's just have a quick intro call, see if I can help. Or if not, you can just DM me directly, ask any questions you might have um, or anything like that. I'm always happy to chat, right? So hopefully enjoy the stare down and maybe see you on a call soon. Cheers.